I wake up every single day and I'm getting paid to play football in the state of California at the highest level. Feel good about yourself. Hey, let's go Niners. Um, I mean, I'm always just in a great mood um, and I just like that fun and I've always said that football is a lot easier when you're having a good time and so I just kind of try to bring that positive energy every single day, every single game. All that matters is, you know, what we believe in in-house and uh, I think we, we believe that we have a really good team and if people want to start, you know, saying that we have a good team and hey, that's awesome. We have such a great locker room, we have such a great group of guys and, you know, when success comes with that, it just, uh, it makes it even more fun. Wow! We're just going to keep clicking along. Here they come. It is Kittle. And did he get to the end zone? He got it in for a touchdown. It's a great job by Trent Taylor. So I kind of think back, though, to the, to the Indianapolis game. When you caught that one, they targeted you on fourth down, I think, to, mm -hmm. to tie it in traffic, as he just said. But what did that play kind of mean to your confidence and your development in your rookie season? Uh, the biggest thing for me was just that um, – because we practiced that play, we installed it the whole week. Um, and just for me, it was just Coach Shannon, you know, he trusts me. He's like, hey, I'm going to give you the ball in fourth down, like make a play with it. Uh, so, I mean, that kind of makes your confidence skyrocket when your coach is giving you the ball in fourth down in a you know, win or lose situation. I'm just happy to be where I am. And, you know, I'm just glad that I get opportunities. I'm just going to keep trying to capitalize on those. You're taking a look back, though, at some of the biggest stars from 2018. Each day, one of us choosing a top NFL playmaker to give our favorite or most memorable moment from their season. And it got to be my player of the day. And I just don't know who had a better year than 49ers tight end George Kittle. Talk about it. He broke out as a tight end, had an opportunity when things were looking real, real gloomy for that team. He took advantage of the opportunity. He got engaged. Yeah. He was at the Super Bowl with sponsorships. Like, what a year for him. Peter, what stood out the most? It's funny because I, he wasn't really on my radar last year when he was a rookie. And this year, kind of had some games, but they were such a bad team that it was like, you're not watching them. And then Thursday night, they come on NFL Network. They're playing the Raiders, their crosstown rivals. And everyone's attention is to them because it's a Thursday night game, the only show in town. And Nick Mullins is under center for the first time in his career. Cool little story. And George Kittle steals a show with his one-handed grab. And then after the catch, goes the distance. Kittle, oh, wide receiver skills, can play the tight end. He's fighting, he's fighting, gets down to the five-yard line. But this catch was something special. Really put me on my radar that George Kittle is going to be a game breaker and a special player in this league. Thursday night, national television, and go on to win that game. One of the greatest rookie debuts ever for a quarterback mm. had by Nick Mullins and no shortage of talent Very on long. that field. And George Kittle Peter, is the guy who stole the show. Could you be the guy that everyone looks at and says that is the tight end of the generation? Uh, for me, I want every single tight end to be the tight end of the generation. I am so pro tight end. It's fun to see guys in my position succeed. I like seeing when Kelsey goes for 150 yards and two touchdowns. I like seeing Zach Ertz have 12 catches in a game. National tight end day. I think I talked to Ebron about it for a little bit, and he just called me a fool. <laughs> Kittle wanted this thing called National Tight End Day. Yeah. Let's go then. I would love at a night game have like a TE signal going up into the clouds. That'd be pretty amazing, actually. <laughs> That'd be wild. I don't know, something like that that's just kind of fun, but still uh, kind of old school, because I kind of view myself as an old school tight end. It wasn't a goal at the beginning of the season. My goal is just to win football games. But that just kind of, you know, how the season played out. You were number one! Got a lot of targets. To be able to, you know, see my name up there with some of the best tight ends to ever play the game is an honor. I got to kind of, you know, bask in the glow a little bit. That was an amazing season. Yeah, but uh, hasn't really hit me yet, but it's definitely uh, exciting. And, um, I mean, it definitely wasn't just me. I mean, you had three quarterbacks throwing me the ball. You had, you know, our O-line, our, you know, just ups and downs throughout the year, guys in and out. But, you know, it's just a credit to our team just to keep pushing, grinding the whole year, no matter what happened. Um, I definitely would have really you know, enjoyed a win today, but this definitely you know, makes it a little bit better. That means everything to me. Those are guys that I've looked up to. Those are guys that I've watched their film countless, uh, countless hours, just trying to take little tidbit, tidbits from each of their games. Um, and the fact that, uh, you know, like I said, Coach Annie gave me the opportunity to get that um, you know, all season long. Uh, I mean, that's a lot on him, and I just appreciate everything. And you know, the fact that uh, you know, my name's on that list now with those guys, it, 
Uh, it means a lot. Like I said, it hasn't really hit me yet. Um, I'm assuming it will in the next like 10, 15 minutes. Um, but I, I'm, I'm overly happy. Stars of this Super Bowl are you two. I mean, it's, usually it's the quarterback or there's a few uh, stars. There. There's, there's yeah. stars there. A couple guys, yeah. But you guys are the personalities. You guys are the soul of your teams, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, are you a dancer? No, I struggle. I struggle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you see, oh, you got loose hips. Yeah, you got some moves. Travis is a guy that, you know, I watched him when I was in college. And then my first time meeting him was last year when he played the Chiefs. He came up to me, said hi. He said hi. It was, yeah, what's up, man? Hey, hey George. Hey, what's up, George? <laughs> hi, George. Yeah. Yeah, was, I mean, but like, for me, like, that was a guy that I've been watching. You know, I mean, to me, like, one of the best sides in, in the NFL. And I was just like, holy cow, like, Travis Kelsey just said what's up to me. And then next thing I know, at the end of the season, he sends me his jersey as, like, a Christmas present. I mean, that was one of the coolest things that's yes. ever happened to me. When you have someone like that in your corner, it's pretty special. You know, yes. and, then, uh, and then Kittle comes in the league and just, he's a madman when he has the ball. Yeah, madman. Dude, dude, just a madman. Mad like, man. he came up to me like, I'm just fast. I'm like, no, you are a son of a buck when you got the ball. <laughs> like, you are running through stuff, around stuff. Bibbs now does a good job to pick up a rusher, and that lets Beathard hit George Kittle, and George Kittle pulls his way in for a touchdown. He's not out of bounds. I love it. It is a 49er touchdown. Not everyone wants to be physical on a football field for some reason. Like, so when I, you know, get the ball and I square a guy up and I see him like he's kind of slow plays it, I'm going to try to run through his face. It works for me. Yeah. <laughs> so for me, like, when you pancake a guy and you feel their breath exhale, like, to me, that's their soul leaving their body. Uh -huh. like, they just soul. took their man card? Yeah. Wow. Like, that's, like, that's what it means to me. So, I respect like, that's, that. There's George Kittle. Who do you to go, boy? Best tight ends in football. What a catch by Kittle! A one-handed grab! Kittle with a big play! And the stiff arm! George Kittle! Wide open! George Kittle! Touchdown San Francisco! Touchdown! What a play! Diving for the end zone! He's in! Touchdown San Francisco! And he's going to break the all-time record! What an unbelievable year for George Kittle! And here goes Kittle again, off to the races, still going, Kittle! Throws medal, caught! George Kittle with a tremendous catch for George Kittle. Garoppolo's <laughs> first throw is a big one, and George Kittle into the open field. The rookie tight end. Garoppolo on second down, complete. George Kittle, can you throw? What the knock?